my name is Victor Munoz. Some of you guys might know me. A lot of people might not know me. I got into bodybuilding uh, because of a great friend of mine. His name was Carlos Awet. A U E D. He, um, I was into martial arts growing up in Washington Heights in Manhattan. And um, one day uh, I wasn't doing the arts that day, so I, I decided that he says, let's, uh, let's work out. And I say, work out? I don't work out. And he goes, I exercise with, you know, gymnastics and chins and push ups, but weight training I never done at that time. He takes me to the gym, I got an incredible pump. I was hooked from there. And I used it for my wrestling, my martial arts, uh, played football, baseball, uh, but this is what I love more. And I just consumed it more, try to find more things about it, help them to get his first show. Bodybuilding to me is probably one of the hardest type of sports because if you've really done it to a full extent, you know what it is to diet. You know what it is to train hard. The next morning, you have to get up and go to work or go back to the gym. And your body's like all beat up. And you, it's not like you say, well, I'm taking off today. Only the weak guys take off that day. The guys who are true, they're, they're here the next day. And bodybuilding is something like, almost like trial and error. So you find what actually clicks for you better. I started lifting because of sports, not because of um, I was already in martial arts. I already knew how to kick, pretty much defend myself. So I didn't need a bodybuilder to say, oh, don't mess with me. You know, the guys that walk with the imaginary lats, those are the guys that give back conception to bodybuilding. Even Martinez, you see, ever see Martinez walk? He doesn't look like a real bodybuilder because he walks like he's like a 110 pound guy. And he doesn't feel like he's the biggest guy in the room or he's trying to intimidate anybody. He knows who he is. Not like those guys who start lifting and they're walking around like this. Those are the guys that not found themselves. And any sport that would have taken, they would have taken it the wrong way. So just be at ease with yourself. Just get yourself better, that's all. It's about getting better. I've trained actors to rappers, to a painter, a grocery uh, manager. Uh, I not only take athletes, I think everybody that I've, I train is pretty much an athlete training for life, you know?